Hello, welcome to Adip Tutorial. Today we bring you another editor of Microbit, the Mew Micro Python editor, and the use of the editor plugins that many of you are caring about. The Mew Micro Python editor is divided into web page online and online versions. For the online version, you need to open Google Chrome and enter the Microbit official website. Click on less code. Find out Python editor and code. This is the online editor. This tutorial mainly talks about the offline version of new MicroPython. Here I have listed the URL for you. First, copy and paste the URL into the browser. Enter the download page directly and then click download. My computer here is a Windows system and it is 64 bit. So just click it directly. If your computers have other systems, you can choose accordingly. Directly click on 64 bit due to time I have downloaded before. Install it directly here. Click Next. Here you can choose in which disk you want to install. The default disk is also fine. Click install and then wait a minute or two. Finish. As you can see, we have now entered the offline editing page. Here you can choose different modes and we choose BBC Microbit. Here for you to choose to add a new editing page. Import code into the page. Save the written code. Download the code to BBC Microbit. Open files. This is REPL. Click on it. It did not find the relevant driver. And this is also the focus of this tutorial. Now connect the BBC Microbit to your computer. Only when the software recognizes it can the code be downloaded. You can see that the driver has been installed. Here I have installed the plugin. If you haven't installed, it won't appear. Now I'll show you how to install this plugin. Copy and paste the prepared URL into your browser.
and you can see that it is still loading. Click to open, install. Finish. After the installation, both these two functions can be used now. Here and here is zoom in, zoom out. Here you can choose the night or day mode. This is check for correction. If the code has a syntax error, it can also detect it. Help quit. So write the code now. Delete this first. Import micro bit. Be sure to write an asterisk. Then write a loop and let it delay for 20 milliseconds. Print the value of the acceleration sensor. Enter directly. Now we finish coding. The value obtained by the acceleration sensor will be printed. Download to BBC Microbit. Now we click Flash and then REPL. A print messages will be displayed below. Click Plotter and we have to push the button here. Rotate the micro bit. And there comes the data flood detected. To fix this problem, we just have to click OK and change 20 to 200. Now click flash again. Repl and plotter. Also the button here. Now rotate the micro bit. We can clearly see the change of values in this interface. Through this tutorial, I believe you have learned how to use the Mute Micro Python editor and install the required plugins, which will offer more convenience for the future learning. If you still have any questions, post to our forum. We will reply to you as soon as possible. See you.